So I made a little dog toy or a cat toy with an Arduino. Looks like this. It's pretty obvious what it does and how it works, so I think I'm just going to get right into it. Oh, oh wait, I don't have a dog. Might as well explain how it works. Alright, so basically it's a laser pointer automatic thing. Got the idea of some online tutorial site, so I'll go ahead and post the tutorial and all the coding I used for this. Just steal it, because that's how it's done. Um, basically, two servo motors. Um, you are required to use twist ties. If you use anything else, it won't work. And scotch tape, uh, the tape of champions. So you just go ahead and wire up the servos, ground, power, all that jazz. Just go ahead and plug the data cables into any ports you want to use. I used 8 and 9. Have some extra stuff on this breadboard because it's the breadboard for champions. Um, I'm going to go get a dog really quick. I'll be right back. And so I went to the pound and got this beagle, but uh, I, I think it's broken? I, I don't know. It's I ran some tests. I just got a handheld one of these and doesn't doesn't really react. So, I'm just going to go ahead and exchange it and, and go get a new one. Alright, so I took my handheld laser apparatus to the pound with me. And this guy reacted pretty well. So, I, I got him. He's a pug-beagle mix. I, I guess beagles don't like lasers and pugs do. So, I guess in my next video I'll get a full pug and see what happens. He rather likes the laser. Let's see if he'll follow it. No, 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 maybe, maybe. Come here, come here, get over here. All right, so that's the handheld one. Let's go ahead and plug in the Arduino here. Um, someone, someone sabotaged it. Someone took the battery. Is it you? I'll go look for that battery. It's okay. He, he stole it. Let's go ahead and plug the sucker in. He moves pretty slowly because this guy's pretty slow. <laughs> Stupid animal. Anyway, this is how it works. Two motors just shift together. The laser is actually powered by the Arduino. It uh, ran off 4.5 volts originally, and it works fine with 5 volts, so I just did some soldering, I hacked off the back of it. That's where the batteries are held, and originally the positive side would connect to the spring, and you'd have to press that button in there. But I just skipped the button, soldered straight to the connector to the right of the button. There are a couple other places you could have done it, but that's just the negative side actually. The positive side is through the frame, so that's where the 5 volts go. And since that was the case, I just unscrewed the cap here and put the positive wire in between the cap and screwed it down. So it's not actually soldered on there, it's just wedged in there. But, you know, it works. So, twist ties, laser pointer, dog, cat, either one. And yeah, that's pretty much it.